Okay guys, so first and foremost, hello. I'm so happy because I'm back and I haven't had time to film, you know, I've been doing other stuff. So I'm just so excited to be back and, you know, talking to you guys. This top is from Boohoo. These shorts are from H&M. Let's zoom in just a tiny bit. I don't want you guys to see all of my blemishes, but I guess it's important to let you guys know that like I've been slipping on my skincare routine. If you have not watched my skincare routine video, then I'm gonna need you to watch it because if you check my skincare video, you can see that my skin's glowing, it looks healthy. And right now, you know, I've been slacking. I haven't been taking my vitamin C. I haven't been, like there's a lot of stuff I haven't been doing, but we won't spill the tea in this video. Go ahead and check that out. I use this Anastasia Beverly Hills Dip Brow, and then I use the pencil that comes with it. So I just brush upward. Let's zoom in. That's good, okay. So I brush upward. For both these thingies and what I do with my brush I dip it in here and then what I do is I take it and I squeeze it together so it's like the finest little thin brush as possible so that I can really make the sharpest line you want to go the lightest in this area because we just, we don't need a lot of product in the front of the brow. And then what I like to do is if you really, really want to define the arch, you just kind of flick the brush up. Like once you get to the arch, you just flick upward. Okay, you see that? And then we want to just take a little bit more if you don't have enough product. And then again, I squeeze. And then you just start shading downward. And then there is your brow. So you see that shape that I've got going on there. And then you just want to go up on the top similar con similar concept i like to put my brush as straight as possible because i kind of like the boxy front of my eyebrow so i just kind of put it just like this and i just take it straight line you guys see that i hope you guys see that let's let's zoom in for you guys you guys see that little line right there yeah that's what you need so I do that and then keep going across the brow. And when we get to the actual brow, we're not really drawing over it unless you want your eyebrow to look thicker than it actually is. I'm kind of just like defining the top of the brow. So I'm not going over the hair, I'm kind of coloring into the hair. Then once we get to that arch, we want to take it and bring it down, just like that. Okay. And see how we still got a little bit of stuff here? That's what Q-tips are for. So... Just gonna take this Q-tip and clean that up right there. Yeah. So there is your first brow. And I'm gonna move on to the second one and do the same thing. After I do that, I just brush, 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 brush. You don't want to brush too hard because you want to keep that shape, but just kind of get rid of those harsh lines in there. And 
Next thing I'm going to do is go in with the LA Girl Pro Conceal. I don't use this brush that's on it. I know a lot of people do. What I do is I find my own fine tip brush. So I'm going to use this brush here. I've had it for ages. It's called the Small Angled Brush by e.l.f. So I'm just going to take it and... Just squirt a little, little bit out and then just dab it in there. And then I still kind of go like this because I'm not really looking for a huge, you know, concealed eyebrows. I don't really want my eyebrows to be like, she concealed her eyebrows. I just want it to be like, these are some crisp, natural eyebrows that you'd see every single day. <laughs> Am I zoomed in good enough for you guys? Let's get in there. Okay. And what you want to do when you're concealing your eyebrows is don't go right in there. Like, you know, right to the edge of your arch unless you are just really good at this. I usually start farther back and then I work my brush in. And then I just take what's left on my brush and I just comb down. So we're going to take some more of this and we're going to do the same thing with the other brow. My last step that I do with my brows is I like to set them in place with this e.l.f. Um, it's a lash and brow brush. So what that's going to do is that's just going to really set your brows in place. Okay guys, so this is my brow tutorial. Um, definitely not perfect, but if you're looking for a natural brow look, then this is your go-to, I'm telling right now. <laughs> you won't regret it. So thank you so much for watching and I hope you enjoyed. I hope that, you know, your brows are on bleak mode and you look good. And everybody think you're looking good because you watched my video. Cassidy Faye. I need to start saying my name in my videos. I always forget, but Cassidy Faye, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed and I hope you learned something. Bye-bye-bye-bye-bye.